For those of y'all who got their wedding plan and you ready for that honeymoon, you're going to finally go to Hawaii. Yeah, we're going to Hawaii finally. Okay, that's good, okay? I don't know if you should be taking United Airlines. They just got a lot of stuff going on. We got the other man, got the bloody mouth, and now we got this. According to the multiple reports, we got a dude named Richard. He was on the flight from Houston to Calgary when the creature that appeared to be a scorpion fell down from the overhead pass and bit him. Now, now scorpions don't bite people. They, they sting people. Well, they look like they bite people. They sting. They don't bite. Well, if they don't bite, then how do they eat then, huh? Tell me that. All right, here's a quote from Richard. The Mexican guy next to me said, that's a scorpion. It's dangerous. So I dropped it on my plate, and then I went to pick it up again, and that's when it stung me. See, that's the problem. You shouldn't have picked it up. And it felt like a wasp sting. It wasn't clear what the creature was doing on the flight. What other options does a creature have? I mean, besides just walking around and stuff. Maybe they're trying to say, why is the creature on the airplane? Like, how'd he get on there? Bell said another passenger stumped on it after it stung him, and it was quickly thrown out. So it's not clear if the creature was actually a scorpion. Well, dang, what was it then? A big roach? I heard them Madagascar roaches bite. Who knows what it was? Bottom line, the man got bit on the plane. Red, silver, J. Ooh. All I gotta say.